Good morning, first grade. Welcome back to a new week. Because we're starting a new week, I thought I would show for you real quickly again what you're supposed to do with your sight words for this week. So uh, why don't you go ahead and make sure that your name is on your paper. That's a great start. And this week, today, Monday, we are starting with the word come. Come is the first sight word that we are looking at this week. So you have two jobs. Job number one, you need to trace the word come. So you can feel for how large your letters should be with each other. Okay? So first we went ahead and we traced it. And then we're going to go ahead and write it. And you can actually see that they have put little dashes at the bottom. That's so that you know exactly where to put your letters. Isn't that cool? Okay? Or you can at least do your best with making them that way. Okay, you could have made your M a little bit bigger, but it's okay, just like it is. So after we have traced it and we write it, now we need to build it. Now remember, in order to build it, you are going to need your scissors and a glue stick. Remember that we're going to take these letters that are at the bottom and we're going to cut straight along the bottom. So I'm going to cut along the bottom here. Okay, and then I need to find the letters that I need for the word come. I need C, O, M, and E. So I'm going to go ahead and cut out the letters that I need. And I'm just going to, it's easier for me just to go along this dashed line right away at the bottom. And then put your scraps to the side, but don't let, get them, don't let them get mixed up with your um, with your letters. So we need the O, C, O. I need the C, don't I? So I'm going to cut out the C and you're cutting it out right on the dashed line. So we have C, O. We need M, which is in the middle here. So you'll find the M. C O M, and then I'm going to lastly find the E. So I found my E, I cut it out, and I'm going to set it up here. Okay, now that I've traced it, I wrote it down, I built it, I have to finish building it by putting some glue on it. So you're going to go ahead and take your glue stick, and you're going to glue down each of the letters. Now, you can very easily just put the glue right in the box for this because your letter should, if you cut it correctly, should take up your whole box. C, O, M is next. And E is last. C O M E come. Okay. Now that we've traced it, we wrote it down, we built it and glued it together. Now you need to find it. So you on your own are going to find the word come and you can just use your pencil and find the word come. Go ahead and circle it all those times. And then you're going to use the word come in a sentence. Now I could say, would you come to my house? That would be using the word come. Uh, I would like the dog to come here. Okay, I could use the word come that way too. You could have your own way that you're going to use the word come in a sentence. Okay, so remember your sentence is going to start with a capital letter. It's going to end with an end mark. However you choose to use, it is fine. If you're asking a question, remember it's going to end with a question mark. If you are speaking with a lot of expression and feeling, you're going to have an exclamation mark. If it's just a sentence, if it's just a statement, then you're going to just put a period. Okay? When you are done with this, this is going to go in your Monday folder for today. The rest of your sheets are going to look just like this for the rest of the week. So every day this week, you're going to have a sight word practice sheet. 
Have a wonderful day. Make sure this gets in your folder.